who's gonna miss them? Hats off, Noah. You're a stronger man than me. It's a merger of epic proportions. Marinated carne asada steaks, seasoned rice, and a tangy, savory sauce. It's the new Southwest Steak Border Bowl from Taco Bell. To get the total package, you've got to think outside the bun. The Little League World Series begins tomorrow at 6 and 8 on ESPN2. Former champion, Bobby Chez, checking out the action tonight here at ringside in Atlantic City, New Jersey. Bob Papa, Teddy Atlas, glad you can join us. ESPN 2's Friday Night Fights, presented by Miller Highlight, Takumbo Olajide, Gary Watch Jones, over, right? underway, round number three. We take a look at the punch numbers in round number two. Again, a very inactive round for Olajide. Earlier tonight, Mike Stewart knocked out Brad Jensen in the third round. Prince Fadi Ajami, unanimous decision against Alton Rice. John Four knocked out Jason Jenkins. Ooh, Jones goes down from a counter shot. And from that left foot counter shot. Five. The favorite punch, the bread and butter. Eight. The hey, young Bill. and the stronger. Come here, come here. See, that's the problem for this fight, excuse me, Bob, with Jones. Jones cannot afford to make mistakes. Alajide, having lost the first two rounds of these in my scorecard, can make mistakes and still win this fight. Jones. Cannot, does not have the benefit of that erasing, that power. Lajade coming in with eight consecutive knockout victories. You know, in between rounds two and three, Tommy Gallagher in the corner of Lajade said, hey, let's do a little basic stuff here. Let's work the jab, throw the right hand, just do basic, basic stuff, just to get yourself going a little bit. And Lajade was able to land that left. And Lajade got a little help. Jones reached in, the left hook. Found it smart. So you can't make a mistake if you're Jones in this fight. You have to have a game plan and you have to act on it and be disciplined to carry it out to his vision. If you make a mistake, bam! A lot today will pull. It up. Once in a while, get punches off, get to his high. Once in a while, get a lot today, which we saw in the first two rounds. Get a lot today to lead, counter punch to counter punch him. Keep a lot today off balance. You know, it was interesting too, the corner of Elijah they just yelled out when they got in tight. Stay in the pocket, stay right there. He's got no power. You can stay there and take a chance. Absolutely. Good recognition by the corner of the lodge today. Excuse me. New York trainer, Tommy Gallagher. Know your man's strength. Know your man's weaknesses. Watch Clint Eastwood. Dirty out. You will remember. Follow the house. Man must know. Well, the story here in round number three, Kumbo Elijah dropping Gary Jones here in the third round with his left hand. Gary Jones heads back to his respective corner, so does Kumbo Elijah Day. I want you to throw combinations, all right? I don't want you to look for one shot. I want you to get in there and get busy with this guy. I want you to manhandle him. I want you to hit him like a fucking heavy bag. Now, come on. Don't make this tougher than it is. When you throw a left hook to the head, go to the body. Give me body. Go. When you go to the head, go to the body. Right there, let's take a look at the knockdown. Right hand first, then the left hook. As Jones stayed in that pocket a little too long. There's the right hand, doesn't catch him clean, but the left hook. That catches Jones clean, and down goes Jones. It stayed there a little bit too long. Oh, okay. Come on, dog. 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 Gary Russell is Jones' father. They've been together again since the Candelo fight. Of course, Russell, Gary Russell trained Jones when he was a youngster, when Jones was winning all those U.S. amateur titles. Round four has begun. Because the power punches from round number three, Elijah Day, 10 of 22, still quite economical in his punch output. So this 
the kind of fight for Jones to win, have a chance to win, in my estimation, he needs to be ahead comfortably. Has to have some cushion all the way through. He can't fight from behind. Because if he fights from behind, he's going to take chances. And if he takes chances with the stronger lot today, he's going to see the flaws. He's going to see the canvas. He needs to be ahead in this fight. He needs to build up a lead. Well, he just lost his lead by getting dropped in round three. He's got to start getting it back right now, partner. He's got to get things going very specifically. Get that jab working. Get in, get out. Give angles. Olajide is good at counter punch as he is. He needs to be set to be effective. Give him angles. Keep him well balanced. In and out. You mentioned Jones has his father in his corner. Jacumbo Olajide was trained as an amateur by his father, Michael Sr., who works out of the Kingsway Gym in New York. He got it. Michael Jr.'s career, but when Chicago turned pro, he decided to go in a different direction. A left hand again puts Jones down. Was not ruled a knockdown, but it sure looked like Jones took a knee, or at least the glove kept him from going down. But again, it's that powerful left hand from Elijah And again, it's Jones falling in, laying in front of Elijah He has a tendency of reaching in a little bit. When you reach in with a counter punch, you will wind up reaching for the canvas. Corner of Elijah yelling, body, body, body. See, the funny thing here, Jones was doing a good job early in the round up to that point, Bob. Jones was keeping Elijah Day off balance. I thought building a lead. Doing what he needed to do, but as I said earlier, the difficult factor for Jones is he needs to fight a perfect fight. He cannot afford to make mistakes. Elijah Day can make mistakes and still win. And the other thing is, Jones not only has to fight perfectly, but not the sturdiest of chins. He's been knocked out. Knocked out cold once before. Jones must score to all teams, not all his eyes. Elijah Day can scribble and spot out. Well, for the second round in a row, Tukumbo Olajide has dropped Gary Jones. Although it was not officially ruled a knockdown. Now, let's take you to the corner of Tukumbo Olajide. You go right out this round until they stop this fight. Let's stop talking around. Tukumba, how do you feel? Then let's go to work. Yeah, let me tell you something. When you throw that hook to the head, you put it down to the body. And come back with your right hand. Keep your eyes on. Look at this. 